Hello everyone. In today's video, we will test a Bluetooth vulnerability where attacker or third party unauthorized person is able to record audio from a Bluetooth speaker with built in microphone, even though the speaker is already paired with another device. This vulnerability was discovered by TarLogic. Last week, they already published a proof of concept tool called BlueSpy, which is the tool that we are going to test right now. In this scenario, we have a Bluetooth speaker built in a microphone paired with the an Android device to play music. And then from the attacker perspective, we have Raspberry Pi running Kali. We will use the built-in chipset, Bluetooth chipset to misuse insecure just work pairing, Bluetooth pairing method to connect to a speaker and then record and play back our custom audio. If you want to cover a wider range or area, we can use external Bluetooth adapter with external antenna. We'll connect to Raspberry using our Android over SSH. Let's start. We'll turn on the speaker. We have a smartphone. Was paired and it works. Now our goal is to identify the MAC address of the speaker using a Bluetooth CTL tool. We'll initialize the scan and we see that there is our blue play P2 and we got the MAC address. We will use this MAC address for our blue spy script. I already tested it, so it's all set up. But the script crashed. The problem is that we need to now execute three more commands manually to make it actually work. The first one. And right now we will execute the command that will record the, the audio. The LED has changed, LED light. Right now we are testing the sprue of concept where attacker is able to eavesdrop on the Bluetooth speaker. Let me kill the action and now we will play the recording back to the speaker. Of course we can play any audio. I hope you could heard the audio. It was super quiet, but it actually works. The user is still able to play music. This was a real case of exploiting insecure and just work Bluetooth pairing with um, Bluetooth headset, Bluetooth speakers where attacker just misused the, the pairing, find the device and was able to eavesdrop to record uh, microphone audio then play back um, any audio he wants.